What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. For those of you who don't know, my name is Chris Moore and in today's video, we got a bunch of 2022 Hayabusa's that I wanted to update you on and let you know a little bit about what we going on. First off, we got mine. Next up, we got some other bikes that we're gonna show you that we've got different exhaust systems on. So just to show you an example of how they sound on the same camera, both cold engines, and then we got a bone stock one that you can compare that to. And then we're gonna talk about the new giveaway bike. Yeah, that's right, boys. We got a 2022 Hayabusa giveaway coming up soon. Stay tuned for all the details. Here we go. guys finally we got an update on my 2022 hayabusa you guys know you saw this thing in a bunch of videos and all of a sudden you quit seeing it well that's for one we've been waiting on and trying to develop and design new products for this thing so literally it has just been sitting basically in a standstill in the corner waiting on carbon smith to design us some velocity stacks so they made us some velocity stacks you see those here super short ones we put those in the bike lost horsepower didn't do what we wanted to do so we called him up we had to go back to the drawing board and he has designed us another set of fine velocity stacks that we're going to be putting those in today and installing those and seeing how they do we've also got a sprint air filter well i was supposed to have a sprint air filter i went to go get it from my parts guy shane he's like yeah sorry boss i sold it so anyways we have been selling the snot out of these sprint air filters we do have them available or we did have them available for a 2022 hayabusa we will have more back in stock this week if you guys want one of those you can call the parts guy shane he can get you hooked up on that next thing you're going to notice is a bazaz we have taken a bazaz from a 2017 and up platform gsxr 1000 and we have rewired and reconfigured a few things to make this work we do have it we have tested it we put it on the dyno it does work perfectly no issues no nothing so technically can we tune a 2022 hayabusa yes if you get us a bazazz we can go in and tune the bike does that mean it's de-restricted no unfortunately not we have not got the code for the ecu or whatever i'm not the software developer i'm not the code cracker i'm just the tuner we do not have the stuff available. Hopefully Woolwich Racing will maybe have it available by the end of the year. That's what we're hoping for, but no promises on that. So anyways, enough about this bike. Let's walk out here to the showroom. I'll show you the brand new bikes that we got out here. Oh, right here, 2021 GSX-R1000. It's back running, finally all back together. This is mine. You've been seeing it sitting right over there in the corner for quite some time now. Yeah, that's right, boys. She's finally back running. Let me fire it up for you, just to prove it. Ooh, she's not good. Still breaking in the brand new motor. This thing is gonna be a beast. I'm gonna put a short swing arm on this thing. For all of you roll on guys that think more mafia can't compete in roll on, let you know I'm coming for you. Draggy times, whatever you want to do, I'm coming to bust that ass. All right, guys, let's roll out here to the showroom. I'm going to show you what we got going on with the new boosters. There's the 2020 GSX-R1000. We just did the giveaway with it. Customer in Arkansas was lucky enough to win that thing, take home the grand prize. He's supposed to be coming to pick it up here in about two weeks. But let's show you what these new Hayabusa's we got lined up is. First off, we've got a bone stock one that we're gonna fire up and let you hear run. It's brand spanking new. This is actually the bike we're gonna be doing for the giveaway. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take it apart and paint it. We're gonna change this black and copper. Black here, copper here, the copper is getting changed out. We're gonna change this to make this a custom one-off bike to show everybody that basically just make it stand out from the crowd nothing crazy just to make this bike a little different from all the others 
Comment in the comments below, what color do you think would look best should we paint this? Gray, green, pink? You tell me, what would your choice of color be? I've got a color in mind that I think would look super, super good on this thing. Just let me know what you think. I'm think, I go ahead and take. Me personally, I think gloss black and we paint this matte black. So everything that's copper, paint it matte black. Basically be an all black edition. 2022 boost i think it would look killer but anyways this is it boys this is the giveaway bike we're gonna try to do this giveaway come black friday uh, i've talked to brock's performance and i have got the parts on order hopefully we're able to get them we got bst carbon fiber wheels we got titanium exhaust we got all the goodies that we're trying to get lined up for that coming soon next up 2022 hayabusa with a brock's alien head exhaust this bike is lowered with the Brox window link lowering kit and the Brox performance tie down strap kit. We got it all ready to go. Then we got another one here, pretty much the same setup as mine. Does not have the rear seat cowl on it yet, but this has the Brox CT single with a full lowering kit. And it also has a front and rear brake caliper delete that we did here at More Mafia. We took the mirrors off we got this thing sitting a little more drag race prepped and ready but the main thing is we want to do a sound test today to show you what these things sound like let's crank up the bone stock one first you can see this thing is brand spanking new with zero miles on the clock there you have it guys i'm going to try to stand the same distance away from it each time so you can hear this thing this is a cold start engine is completely cold we'll let it warm up a second we'll give it a few revs then we'll move on to the next bike. crazy revving it but you can tell the engine's cold what do you think stock eh. not too good sounds kind of like a vacuum cleaner right all right now let's move on to the brock's performance alien head exhaust for those of you who are shopping for an exhaust system you could hit us up moremafia.com we can get you the exhaust system you need whether it be a brock's performance or if you damage your stock exhaust i got plenty of those sitting around too i'll sell you those cheap <laughs> here to the brock ct single this is a full titanium system this bike also has zero miles on it it's brand spanking new one we just sold customer is set to take delivery of it today cold start on it you see all these things are pumping a little bit of smoke because they're brand new exhaust so the i guess you say the new is still burning out of the exhaust don't think anything is wrong with the bike it's not like that
right guys, comment in the comments below. Which one did you like the sound of best? Let me know what you think. I don't, you know, I got that one on my bike, but man, it's tough to beat the sound of the alien head. But I just look, look, you can see a little smoke coming out of this one. You can tell it's brand spanking new, boys. So fresh, so clean. Anyways, I just prefer the titanium exhaust. The, the pitch and the sound of it is just a smidge different. It does cost a little bit more, but it is definitely a high quality exhaust system. All right, guys, that's gonna do it for today's video. If you like what you saw, click the subscribe button, click the bell for notifications, smash that like button, Check us out, moremafia.com. If you want Brock's exhaust or whatever kind of exhaust you want, hit me up. I don't have an online store quite that fancy to offer all the products, but we are working our way up to it, guys. We do have the O2 sensor conversion harness, so you can put both your O2 sensors in these Hayabusa exhaust pipes, regardless of what year exhaust or what year bike they're designed to fit. In other words, you could take a Gen 2 exhaust and put it on a Gen 3 with our O2 sensor adapter harness. All right, guys, like I said, moremafia.com. We just got a fresh shipment of hoodies in. Check them out. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time. All right, guys, we're back. I couldn't leave you hanging out with getting these engines hot and giving some good revs. I got them all warmed up. <laughs> Baby Boosa. <laughs> Hey guys, see you next time.